Hey, we're from the St. Croix River Education District. I'm Nick. I'm Courtney. And I'm Rye. So we're talking about rationales today. And um, I think one thing I remember very clearly about teaching in the high school, especially when we got to those pretty advanced math classes, was why do I have to do this? I'm never going to use this ever in my life. And I think it was really, it got to be really tricky to try to rationalize these kids because, yeah, you probably aren't going to use calculus, like, mm -hmm. if what you want to do but your brain's going to work faster. You're going to be smarter overall for knowing it. Um, but like Nick, what? I was Sorry. just going to say, um, uh, it, it's tough when you're put in that on the spot position, because I've been in there too. So the students are asking you that question. And then you kind of end up feeling like you're in a power struggle because you just start to rationalize and, and just get into that. It's, it's a lot better and more advantageous when we just build that into our routine and we start talking about it proactively um, because students then don't have to ask that question. Like they may not buy your answer of why it's important, but at least you're offering it first. Um, mm -hmm. And like even for adults, like having a rationale for why are we learning this? Why are we talking about this is important. Um, in our trainings um, with the St. Croix River Education District, we generally have like slide two is why and we talk about like, hey, what is this going to do for us? Um, so just offering those rationales proactively and like Courtney, you were just talking about like a general one about math, like just mm -hmm. building your your mental dexterity and your problem solving skills. Um, I think that's a good one. Um, having students generate their own connections is another way to do it because sometimes like having to come up with it you're just i'm not creative today it's february it's seven in the morning i can't come up with a, a student relevant reason why this is important so like rye you talk about routine all the time like a routine before a unit or even before like at the beginning of the week can be like hey here's what we're going to cover let's do like three minute writing activity like what am i hoping to get out of this and you can kind of say to students like, hey, you know, like, I know half of you are, are interested in being TikTok stars um, when you grow up. So maybe you're, <laughs> maybe you're not going to use this skill set if you're a TikTok star. But like, we're going to be working on this for like 45 minutes a day for the next week. Let's just reflect like, what can I get out of this time? Um, so just building that routine in and getting there first before you're asked that question and put on the spot. Um, but that rationale is so important for, for just having some buy-in. All right, guys, thanks for your time. Have a good one.